So my name is Helena Mangs. I'm the Chief Operating Officer and Deputy Director of the Ramachandra Centre for Genomics. The Ramachandra Centre is a genomic service provider located at the University of New South Wales. And we've been in operation since 2000. We were established in 99. So for 23 years now, we've been doing genomic services. We offer next generation sequencing, Sanger sequencing, genotyping, and all other genomic technologies. So the cellular genomics platform works very closely with the Ramachandra Centre because everything we do essentially generates a short read libraries that need sequencing as their data output. Through that partnership, the Garvin Institute generates single cell libraries using the latest technologies, and then we leverage the high throughput capabilities of the Ramachandra Centre for sequencing. One of the reasons researchers send their samples to us is trust. They trust that we operate at the highest level of quality and we'll get them the results that they need for their analysis. I would describe Illumina as a leader in the field of genomics. The Ramachandra Centre has a long history of working with Illumina, and we have a very close relationship with them. The technology that they produce enables research across all sorts of fields. What my lab is interested in is understanding prostate cancer health disparity. Men with African ancestry are at elevated risk of prostate cancer. And of course, this could represent both environmental factors as well as, of course, genomic factors. Ultimately, where we want to get to is two objectives. One is to decrease the inequity that exists in prostate cancer and two, to develop a program of precision medicine that is actually global and includes everybody. I regard every man that donates his sample to us as, as gold. You've made a promise to an individual. So I need to know that when that sample enters another lab, that they treat that sample the way we'd want to treat it and that we get the most out of that sample. This is the kind of partnership that I have always had with Ramachiati, and it's a growing partnership. I always say it's a, it's a relationship because you're doing this together. We were keen to get the NovaSeq X Plus in the lab because we're always trying to stay at the forefront of the technology. The NovaSeq X Plus will enable more researchers to access sequencing. The 25B flow cell will enable researchers to sequence more samples, which will increase their statistical power of their studies it's more cost effective and has higher throughput. With the NovaSeq X, the in increase in capacity is something we are really looking forward to as single cell projects get larger and more complex. What excites me about the future of genomics, three things primarily. One is around sample prep, enabling a diverse range of sample types. So the second one is spatial transcriptomics, where we can match the sequencing data with histological data. And the third one is multiomics, where we are getting the maximum amount of information from each individual cell. We're really moving into a world of data science because the more data, the more information, the more we pull out, the better we can treat and manage complex diseases. We are starting to merge multi-omic data together and really use computational tools to try to figure out way more hidden in this information that we rarely thought we would find before. And that's exciting me, is what messages will we uncover? I really truly believe that the world and the era of precision medicine is now coming.